Hey, it's Tony Talking Car Biz. Today's video, I'm gonna dive inside and take a look at the interior on this brand new 2021 Toyota Camry. Now this is an SE Camry and it is the all-wheel drive edition, which is new for 2021. Today it snowed about eight inches, so be sure and catch my test drive video. But for today, let's dive in and learn what you get for 30 grand on an SE all-wheel drive Camry. Okay, it's a little bit windy out, but uh, let's take a look at the door. So we've got brushed aluminum trim all along the door. Power windows all the way around, auto up and down on all four power door locks, power mirrors, bottle holder down here, and speaker in the door. Kind of a neat sculpted design to the door. Reflector down on the door here for safety when you open your door at night. Take a look at our driver's seat. So these are a soft tech fabric seat with a cloth interior and kind of a suede racing stripe down the center. This one does not have a moonroof, but it is an option. Adjustable headrest up and down, height adjustable seat belts, side airbags, side curtain airbags all the way around, including the back seats. You've got an eight-way power driver seat with power lumbar support. Over here on the side of the dash, there's some switches. Automatic high beams, traction control on and off, trunk release, gas door release, and then this one has the cold weather package. So that's your heated steering wheel on and off switch. Trip meter, dimmer switch for your dash lights. Tilt steering wheel here. Wanted to point out the, uh, the satin black or the gloss black trim with the gunmetal gray trim. And you've got four of these vents running all the way across the dashboard. Let's go ahead and jump in the driver's seat. Okay, behind the wheel of the SE, the steering wheel is leather wrapped. It is padded, quite thick. It's Toyota's three spoke steering wheel. On the left hand side, we've got controls for our information center, which is up here in the gauge cluster. We'll take a look at that in just a minute. Bluetooth connecti connectivity for your smartphone, voice activation, Toyota badge right in the center, driver's side airbag. Over on this side, we've got our controls for our cruise control our safety sense settings for uh, dynamic radar cruise control and our lane departure sound system controls over on this side you see we've got controls for our washer wipers which are intermittent up front and then the SE does have paddle shifters so there's your shift up right there and then over on the left hand side is the shifter to shift down headlight controls are over here and we do have automatic on and off headlights, daytime running lights or LED. The headlights are LED bi-directional. No fog lights on the uh, SE, kind of surprising. Take a look at our gauge cluster. Uh, this isn't all that great. Let me, uh, let me just pull around here. All right, sorry about that. So the gauges are black with white lettering, so they're kind of a backlit gauge. And then you notice we do have the uh, needles are mechanical and so they're white as well. We've got our information center right here in the middle, uh, it, which is where you can set up your personalization, uh, particularly around the uh, safety sense. So if I go ahead and switch through there, there's my lane departure, pre-collision, blind spot monitoring, rear cross traffic alert. All of those things can be changed right here on the steering wheel using your fingertips. We also have uh, sign de uh, detection, so road sign detection, whole bunch of great stuff with outside temperature, uh, digital clock. Of course, you've got your speedometer and your fuel gauge over here as well. Heading over, take a look at our center stack. So this is a new design for 2021, the center stack on the Camry. Um, they, they brought it up off the dash and it's kind of like a tablet style. So it's more vertical than it was before on the 2020s, 2021's all new. Gloss black trim all the way around the outer edge of it. Um, we do have a nice little audio suite. So we've got Sirius satellite radio, Bluetooth, AM, FM, of course. And then we also have Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, and it's Alexa compatible. So you can set up all those uh, great features on there as well. 
Uh, moving down the center stack, we have automatic temperature control. On the SE, it's driver side only, so you can set it up here, but not passenger side. And then we do have, of course, front window defrost, rear window defrost, and heated outside mirrors. Um, with the cold weather package, you do pick up the, um, as I said, the heated steering wheel, the heated seats, all of those. So the heated seats are down here. Uh, three different temperatures for just the front driver, front passenger. We have the um, parking brake. It's an electronic parking brake. We've got our cup holders here. Kind of a charcoal gray center console here. So they use that um, brushed aluminum on the doors, but then as you get into the center console, it turns into this kind of metallic uh, charcoal gray. Your uh, transmission's an eight-speed automatic transmission on the four-cylinder engine, and then this is leather-wrapped and then you can move it all the way down and actually do your own shifting if you want to with that. As I've got it in reverse, you'll see we do have backup, uh, it's a color backup monitor and we do have the ability to trace or predict our path. Uh, that's that yellow line in the middle, so that's kind of a nice feature uh, when you're backing up. Down here is our USB charging uh, ports throw some lights on there 12 volts charger or power port great place to throw your cell phone this is not a wireless charging pad but it is rubber coated so your your phone won't slip around and then if we open that up it gives us a nice deep storage compartment good place to stash your stuff and get get them out of out of sight out of mind take a look at the upper dashboard here so this is a padded dashboard with a kind of a light gray contrast stitching and then this it's plastic but it looks metal like almost looks like carbon fiber and then all of this up here is gloss black as well so really a nice rich look to the dashboard on the Camry locking glove box full-size glove box with owner's manuals bottle holders in the doors of course power windows power door locks passenger assist grips up here we've got uh, vanity mirrors but they're not lighted and then the visors do come out and they do have extenders on there on both driver front passenger here we've got a sunglass holder LED reading lights for up front safety connect and then your standard day night mirror with the flip up and flip down feature so no compass in that no garage door openers just your standard flip up manual mirror take a look at our center armrest on this it's really wide plenty of room for two arms it's stationary but check this out when that thing pops open lots of room in there plenty of room and then there's two charging ports uh, old school usb and a usb c charging port on there as well which is the USB-C is new for 2021 so not a lot of changes for 2021 but some nice minor ones particularly around the uh, center stack and that USB charger on the inside let's go ahead and uh, jump in the back seat and see what's there okay diving into the back seat on the door more of that brushed aluminum with the alum aluminum door handle of course we do have power window with a backlit switch uh, place for two bottles of water down there and a speaker in the door the back seats are just like the front they're soft tech fabric with cloth inserts and then you see I've got 40% of the seat folded down right now so you can pop that up there is a ton of leg room in the back of a Camry for adults I'll jump in and show you how much leg room there is so I've got the uh, front seat all the way back, and you can see there's a good three, maybe four inches of knee room. There's pockets on the backs of both front seats. There's a storage cubby down here. The only thing that's missing, or one of the things that's missing, is there are no USB charging ports in the back seat of the Camry. Kind of odd. Uh, we do have an overhead dome light. We do have passenger assist grips with laundry hooks. Three seat belts with shoulder belts in the back. We do have um, side curtain airbags and we have side uh, seat airbags as well in the back seat. And then there's child safety seat anchors right down here to plug in your kiddos car seats. 
and then there is a folding armrest right here that opens up and gives you two cup holders right in the center so really a very comfortable back seat uh, and you should be able to fit three adults pretty comfortably back here here's a quick look at your driver's cockpit from the back seat okay moving into the trunk it's got a nice low lift over height and it opens up pretty wide so pretty easy to get things in out in and out uh, and it's wide enough from here from this side over to this side you'll be able to put uh, two sets of golf clubs in there there's a place back here to hang your grocery bags and you can get a cargo net as an accessory if you want to put one of those across the back this one does have the all all weather floor mats 259 so you get the cargo liner in the trunk and then you get the car the front seat and the second row seat as well and then up under here we do have a cargo light and there's your fold down seat so again I've got 40% of the seat folded down and you can fold down 100% if you want the releases for the seats are up here and then up on the deck lid this is um, insulated and there's an emergency release handle here if somebody gets stuck in the trunk it's glow in the dark so it's nice and safe for them so there you go that's a quick over overview of the uh, 2021 Toyota Camry SE all-wheel drive this one is silver sky metallic uh, be sure to watch the other two videos on this Camry so I did a test drive video and I will be doing an exterior walk around video if you like the video give us a thumbs up if you want more like this feel free to subscribe turn on the notifications this is Tony talking car biz thanks for watching